Oh, freaking breathing that thing. Oh yes, everybody, I did just get back from The Last Jedi and... <sighs> wow. Just wow. This is an excellent, excellent Star Wars movie. And you know what? This is one of the few times that I will not tell you what the movie is about. Because I feel that if I did so, I'd be spoiling something on accident. Because I cannot talk about this movie without accidentally spoiling something. Let's just say it involves the First Order, the Rebellion, Rey, and Luke Skywalker. That's about all I'm going to give you. Alright, so let's talk about the positives, and trust me, there are many. And well, the first positive I want to talk about is the action. The action is very, very well shot. These are some of the best lightsaber starship fights we have ever seen in the entire Star Wars series. All of them are shot with perfection, with love. You can feel every single ounce of passion behind the camera. And you can feel the energy leaping off of our characters. You can... This is such a good movie when it comes down to the action. Everything is just... Right. Right. Now, another really good thing is the characters. I won't get, I won't get into plot details because I would be spoiling it, but I will tell you this. Ray is absolutely fantastic as the main protagonist. Snoke is incredibly, incredibly interesting and is very, very unique in where his character goes. Luke Skywalker is the absolute best he has ever been in the entire series. I won't say why, but he is the best ever. And then the one that I want to talk about the most is well, Kylo Ren. His character is so, so different in this movie. And it, uh, this movie honestly made him one of the best, if not the best villain of the, of like the past couple years. That's how good he was in this movie. All the characters are phenomenal. And the final main positive I want to talk about is the writing. The writing in this movie is very, very well crafted. It is very funny at times. It is very, very heartfelt. It is very emotional. It is everything that it needs to be when it needs to be. And all of the arcs that it takes its characters from beginning to end are so damn good. Really, really good. And I love where every character ended up. I won't tell you why. Once again, this is a non-spoiler review. But the writing slash story is very, very good. But now, I'm going to talk about my one main negative with this movie, and that is the pacing. Some of the pacing is very, very off, and it, uh, s specifically with the first act. The, there is a sequence that involves uh, Finn and a character named Rose. I won't say what they are doing, but the, whenever we cut back to their storyline, the movie comes to a halt, and it is very, very slow. It's do it doesn't have the same type of energy seeping off of it like the rest of the movie, like the rest of the movie sequences do. And unfortunately, Finn's character and his story arc is actually my only complaint because it is really bad, and the pacing for it is awful. I can't say anything more than that. You're going to have to look for the spoiler review later. And, well, let's just say this. Stars The Last Jedi is easily it, one of the best Star Wars movies e yet. Right now, I honestly like it more than The Force Awakens. Right now. And The Force Awakens is my second favorite. And, um, I don't know what else I can say. But due to the fact that that story arc with Finn is rather dull and very, very uh, boring and just not as good as the other parts, I'm going to give 
Star Wars The Last Jedi, a 9.5 out of 10. Alright everybody, I hope you guys had a fun time watching this video, though I can't say much. I hope you guys at least listened to me and enjoyed listening to me. Now, we're gonna, now you guys need to look forward to the spoiler review. I, uh, that will be posted sometime tomorrow, and, um, yes. But now, whereas with today's Christmas review, oh, God. It ain't gonna go well. But, but whatever, that's for later. Hope you guys have a great day, evening, night, whatever that time you're watching this, and I'll see you next time.